80 hectares of gorse has gone up in flames in Canterbury, all in the name of science. The burn has taken place at the Rakaia Gorge, with researchers using fire behaviour sensors and drones to monitor it. Keisha Brownlee reports. Standing back and watching tinder dry scrub go up in flames. All good there, Marwan? Firefighters deliberately lighting 80 hectares of mature gorse. It's all part of a scientific experiment to learn what crews have to deal with in the field. To collect data on fire behaviour in these gorse scrub fuels so that we can improve the models we have for predicting how fast fires spread, how big the flames are, how hot the fires are. This blaze is one of six being studied by fire experts from around the world. Over here, those large foil things with sensors sticking out, those are to measure flame speed. These are probably some of the most heavily instrumented uh, research burns uh, uh, the world's ever seen. Each year, 3,000 wildfires burn across 6,000 hectares of land, costing more than $100 million. Some of the worst recently include the Tasman fires last year near Nelson and the Port Hills fires in 2017. The guys are looking specifically at uh, uh, flame dynamics and uh, fire spread characteristics. Usually at a wildfire they're really busy focusing on putting the fire out. So for them to be able to stand around and watch and see the fire behaviour and really talk to the researchers and increase their understanding is great value for them as well. Next, crews will be setting wilding pines alight, watching and learning how to predict and stop wildfire quickly in its tracks. Kasia Brownlee, News Hub.